Hi fairies and welcome back to my channel. It's Loraja Andrea. So this is going to be my part two to my curly hair series. I do have another video out where I showcase another curly hair texture. Um, definitely go and check that out. It is a chit chat get ready with me. So I do showcase another company's um, curly hair, but this one is going to be from Ali Pearl. And this is their Afro Kinky Curly. Um, I decided that, you know, everyone is always looking for curly hair when it comes to spring, summertime. So I pretty much got so much hair from so many different companies as far as their curly hair and I pretty much just picked like the top five or six um, types of textures that I want to showcase to you guys that I personally love and that I think are the best that I have had so far. So you guys saw me in the beginning co-washing the hair and I co-washed it with silicone mix. I wash all of my wigs with silicone mix. That is my ultimate secret to have my hair super shiny, so soft and so easy to detangle whenever need be. So um, always use silicone mix when it comes to co-washing your hair that is just what I have learned over the past couple of months and it has been working for me so I'm going to really define these curls um, I know with some textures some companies hair you don't really need any product then some you do and with this company you definitely need product because this hair gets extremely big when it comes to letting it air dry so in order to tame that I like to put a little bit of product in it so I like to take my Hawaiian silk 14 in one miracle worker. I really love this leave-in conditioner. I actually use it in my hair as well So I'm just gonna be taking this and putting it all through the roots and also combing it down through the ends finger combing it And I also take my denim brush and go through that as well My wig is like literally flying all over the place, but it's cool because you know We just need to get this all up and through this hair okay? So um, you guys may have seen I did go ahead and bleach the closure. I am finally making a wig what the closure you guys have been requesting me to do that so I'm trying to give you guys everything some color some closure some frontal some everything okay and next I'm moving on to my dark and lovely this is their I don't I'm just gonna put in the description exactly what product this is. I actually saw another girl on YouTube use this. I think she uses it in her natural hair and her natural hair wigs. Um, I really like this product for this particular curly hair type. So if you have any type of afro kinky curly hair, I definitely think that you should use like more of the heavy duty curling creams. But if your hair is more like a wave or it's more like a 3B, 3C type of texture, this product I don't really think is necessary because it's so heavy. But when it comes to afro kinky, more of that 4C, 4B hair, I definitely think you should move, use more of like the heavy duty type of creams and the dark and lovely is more of like the heavy duty type of um, curling pomade. So I'm just taking my denim brush and I'm just running that through the hair, making sure that the products are all throughout this hair because when it dries, it gets so freaking nice and the curls are so defined and so silky and just so lavish, you know? Now this is the hair when it is all air dried. You guys are going to literally kill me, but I did not film this makeup look. Actually, no, I did end up filming this makeup look, but I have no idea what happened to the clip. This video is so old, you guys. This this video was literally like two months old. I've had this hair for forever now. If you guys didn't know, I like to wear my hair a lot longer than when I did before. Like before I would literally take the hair out of the packaging, make the wig, make the video, and then never wear the hair again. And I didn't think that that was really fair. I really started to wear my hair, see how the hair really is from all my companies see what's actually worth reviewing what's actually worth making a video for and not cheaping you guys out of your shmoneys because some of you are 
are literally saving up your heart or money to pay for these wigs and pay for this hair that all these YouTubers showcase in their videos. So I didn't want to cheat you guys out of your money anymore. I just felt like I just wanted to do what was right. And that was wear the hair and not be too thirsty for some shit coins with these videos. That's just being honest. <laughs> so you guys may have seen me go through and um, run my blow dryer through the hair. That is basically me stretching the curls. These are super duper defined coily this is a very coily texture so when it comes to coily hair sometimes it's easier to work through the hair and you know maintain the hair and manage the hair by stretching it so that's just been pretty much just stretching your hair and using a blow dryer just to kind of stretch the curls out a little bit it makes it look a lot longer in it also I just I don't know I like it a lot longer I think mean, I like it a lot better when the curls are stretched and I'm also just taking my scissors and just kind of framing my face because this hair gets really big and I have a super super tiny head um, that's kind of why I don't really like wearing coily kinky curls a lot because they get extremely big and my head is so small and sometimes it can literally be like my head is lost in the forest or something so I'm just doing the same thing to the other side and I'm also going to frame the face on that side as well and you guys may see like my, my little um, twisty braid on one side I did take some water and sprayed it in there with no product in the water just sprayed regular water and twisted the hair and I let that dry for a little bit for probably like five minutes and then I let that unravel and then I kind of flipped it out with my hands brushed it through and then that's when I really liked the curl um, that came out from me doing that Now I'm also going to just kind of um, stretch out the back because I didn't really get some areas but yeah I'm just going to stretch out those areas kind of play with the hair a little bit more. I will say beware with this hair because this hair gets extremely big. If you don't put any product in it but if you went ahead and used the same products that I use then you should be fine but just kind of you know take your time when it comes to fluffing up the hair because this hair can get extremely big um like I said this is a closure I used four bundles I could have used three bundles but you know I didn't really know what I was doing in the beginning because I never really wore four bundles in a closure of Kiki Curly I usually use a frontal but I felt like I needed the four bundles, but I really did not. I could have stretched it out and just used three bundles because this hair, like I said, gets extremely big. But I did use a 24 inch closure and 24 inch bundles to match. This is probably the first time I've ever seen a company that actually has really extremely long frontals and closures that actually match the bundles. So that's a huge plus. I do love that they do have long lengths, like 24 inches to match their bundles. So that's freaking awesome. And what else? This hair is so freaking pretty. Like I said, I've had it for like two months now. That's why you guys have never seen me review it because I really want to test the hair out first. Um, I really do love this hair. I think this hair is perfect for somebody that has more of like a 4C to 4B textured hair. I have more of like a 3B textured hair. It's cool though because you guys can see in the beginning my hair is left out. I do have my hair out and then the closure behind. Um, it still blends in perfectly with my hair. I would say this hair has the same curl pattern as mine but when it comes to the texture this texture is a lot more coarse than mine but the curls literally match how my curls look. Um, so that is it guys. I am going to be giving you so many different curly hair videos. Um, you guys already, already, like I said, you guys may have seen my first one. That is with another company. This is going to be my second curly hair video. And I will be giving you guys so many other different curly hair textures you guys may or may not have seen on the market. But that is my job to give you guys everything. I love you guys and deuces.